Pritime Medical is an innovative medical device company that designs, develops, and commercializes minimally invasive solutions for hemorrhage control. Resuscitative endovascular balloon occlusion of the aorta, or RIBOA, is a minimally invasive technique using a balloon catheter to temporarily occlude large vessels in support of hemorrhage control. Introducing the ER RIBOA catheter, designed for use in the emergency and critical care environments, a tool that has been optimized to support rapid and immediate hemorrhage control in situations such as trauma, postpartum hemorrhage, an adjunct in surgery, interventional radiology, and in the pre-hospital setting. The catheter's guide wire free design facilitates rapid placement and its seven French sheath compatibility reduces the need for surgical repair at the access site. The catheter consists of an atraumatic distal P-tip, which helps reduce the risk of catheter migration into branch vessels and aids in correct positioning. The compliant occlusion balloon is designed to support inflation while minimizing injury to vessels. The radiopaque marker bands located on the catheter at the balloon are to assist with positioning under imaging. The unibody shaft design contains a built-in central lumen for blood pressure monitoring via the arterial line port and includes length marks for measurement and proper positioning. The catheter contains two lumens which traverse the length of the catheter and connect to extension lines with stopcocks. The balloon lumen and the arterial line lumen. The orange peel away sheath is preloaded on the catheter shaft to ease insertion of the catheter. The ER Reboa catheter. In a hypotensive patient as a result of blood loss, common femoral access and arterial line placement should be considered. Timely CFA access provides continuous arterial pressure monitoring and is technically easier to do early versus late. CFA access does not mandate ER Reboa catheter placement, but Reboa cannot be performed without it. The first step when placing the ER Reboa catheter is to measure for insertion depth. For zone one, using the catheter P-tip, measure from the sternal notch to the access site, and for zone three, from the xiphoid process to the access site, record your length. Flush the arterial line creating the fluid column to prepare the catheter for blood pressure monitoring. Insert the peel away into the 7 French introducer and advance the catheter approximately 15 centimeters, then slide the peel away back on the catheter shaft. Continue to advance the catheter into the appropriate zone at the pre-measured depth. If available, use of imaging is recommended to confirm placement. During inflation, maintain control of the catheter and inflate slowly. Start with 2 cc's in zone 3 and 8 cc's in zone 1. Monitor the arterial waveform for an increase in blood pressure above the balloon, indicating vessel occlusion. Mark the time of inflation. Secure the catheter to the patient to avoid catheter migration and move quickly to definitive treatment. After hemorrhage control, prepare the team for a potential rebound hypotension as the balloon is slowly deflated. Fully deflate the balloon, holding a vacuum for at least five seconds and close the stopcock, then remove the catheter. The Pride Time Medical ER Reboa Catheter. For more information, please visit our website.